Hi, my name is Vernon Lawyers and it's B Flat Six and today Um I said I would review the ventriloquist, but I found that to be just a sad bit too inappropriate. So I instead decided to uh review envelope, which is basically the same thing. Anyway, these are like online sorta of clip things in a way yeah. But like in in a way, the, I'm sorry, not clips. What am I saying? They're like short films. So anyway, um, they both star Kevin Spacey, both of these, and then there's another one called uh Spirit of Den Denture, I think. Uh, Spirit of a Denture, Den Denture, yeah, something, something like that. Uh, the s starring Kevin Spacey on uh YouTube. I'll probably include a link to Envelope in this video. But anyway, Envelope is about um this man in Russia who um sends letters to his imaginary friend and the first time he did this was when he was like six and then he um like uh, uh he he got a letter back. So then he just decided to keep sending letters and so he would always get them back four weeks later and uh they would all have the markings of like wrong address and stuff and you know he's just started collecting the envelopes and stuff so um yeah so envelope now here and that's that's basically all i can give without giving away spoilers because it's only like uh 18 minutes long but here, I'll put spoiler alert on the screen, and when the spoiler alert thing goes away, you can, uh, you know, play again, or turn up your volume, I, I don't know, it's up to you, but anyway, when, um, so, so, one day, he gets a, uh, a letter back, he, 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 he's sending it for the last time to New Zealand, which is like the last place he hasn't sent a letter to. He makes up everything except the except the country. But anyway, uh, the last thing, uh, the last place he needs is New Zealand. So he sends it to New Zealand, and he gets a writing back. And then, uh, and it's it's a letter from the person uh, he he wrote. Um. So somebody saying how he was sorry about their loss of their uncle Pete, and hopes uh, and hopes a Hortons, uh, stays strong and everything, and so, you know, it's like, oh, how did I get this letter back, from like this made up guy. So, yeah, that's 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 it. And then he sends a letter back, and then like stuff goes down, and it's 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 really interesting to see like everything but anyway still spoiler alert because i'm going to explain what happens if you haven't by this point go watch the video and then come back and listen to this now okay you, you watch the video good okay okay so Basically, what happened, uh, you're probably like, okay, what the heck, I just watched, like, 18 minutes of Kevin Spacey just, you know, going places. So he, w he was just taken by the Russian officer, and it said uh, he would die on an airplane. So the guy he wrote the letter to was his imaginary friend. When he was in the coma, he uh, when he was in the coma for three days, he visit quote unquote visited his imaginary friend in New Zealand and that's where he got the picture from and you know like that you know so the and then uh he the uh the plane crash that was a uh, pre 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 it's a, that that was that was like something he saw in his coma so yeah, that that's that that was that. So yeah. Um 
so probably the uh, the spoiler alert has gone off the screen by now. So, uh, plot, uh, who did good? Oh, Kevin Spacey just always did good. <laughs> Pretty much, you know, like, Kevin, Kevin Spacey and his wife did well. And I, you know, I, I don't, I don't think Kevin Spacey is a ventriloquist or is a Russian. So, the fact that it was believable in both the ventriloquist and envelope uh, was pretty good. Um, what parts were likable? Just the whole overall plot I just found really, really good. I, I liked it more than, vi than the ventriloquist, I would say. And... I would rate it. Mm. I'm gonna have to go and give it a perfect rating of ten out of ten and five out of five stars, cause you know it's it. It kind of feels like it should be a two-hour long movie, but it's you know. It's 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 not. It's I mean like it's well obviously it's not. So it, it feels like it could be a two hour long movie, but you know it's it's summed up in like eighteen minutes, which I guess really is where it belongs in a way. Cause you know like how how do you make more out of yeah like how how do you add more to that? But yeah, so just just warning you before you see the uh, the the thing if you haven't seen it already. Um, y like, uh, there is a bit of language, so, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, well, then again, there was language in, um, Limitless, and I didn't warn you about that, but, anyway. Uh, yeah. That should be about it. And I, okay, so he here's what I'm looking at for, like, a schedule. I'm looking at, um... Uh, reviews on Sunday, then Monday I do, uh, like, Minecraft shenanigans. Wednesday I do, like, like, videos that I have other people in, and then Friday I put up whatever. So, yeah. And I'm, I'm not gonna say, like, one video, I'm gonna say maybe, like, I, I'm guessing as many as I plan on putting up, uh, reviews are only going to be one per week, though, because I want to kind of keep them special. I kind of feel like there's something I like to keep close to my heart. <laughs> anyway, um, thank you for watching, and, uh, yeah, bye.